Welcome back to Darkwood. We just barely survived through night nine, starting day ten here. Thankfully managed to avoid that screeching monstrosity, just barely. So let's prep to leave. Something I'd like to do today is upgrade this workshop, which mostly just requires a toolbox and a little bit of wood, but I got plenty of wood right now. And the toolbox costs 200 from the wolf. So, if I have anything valuable here, I'd like to take it. Although, looking at it, I don't think I particularly do. I'll uh, keep the gas bottle. Dump the chain trap. Oh, also, before I leave, I want to... repair the stuff around here. So, I'm... let's actually just do that first. So let's grab some nails and some boards. Yeah, this so this chain trap I put right in front of this door before that monstrosity started coming after me. And like it's it's just right in front of it, but it didn't trigger it. It's very strange. Nothing under the bathtub. apart. Right, so this got broken. Let's barricade that again. And the monstrosity came from in here, so where did it come from? Okay, that is creepy as hell. The monstrosity came from inside this room, and yet it's still barricaded. How the hell did it get in here? That's unnerving. I guess it can just appear. Great. Well, that's everything barricaded. I'm actually kind of running out of room here. I wonder if it uh, automatically compacts stuff, or if I could actually do some manual compacting. I don't know. Oh, we got a shiny stone. That's worth 130. That's almost enough for the uh, tool box. So what else do I want to sell? Could sell some shotgun shells. Could sell the knife. I mean, let's be honest, I'm probably not going to use it. Although it can be thrown. Hmm. That could be useful. If you throw it, I wonder if you can retrieve it again? I'm gonna keep that. That could be very useful, actually. For throwing. I wouldn't use it in a melee fight, though. Because the fact that it doesn't stun. What else can I sell? Gasoline's not worth that much to sell. It's not worth selling it. Battery, a little bit. Shotgun shells. I guess shotgun shells. <laughs> Nothing that I have is really worth anything in particular. I got a bunch of flares. Which reminds me, I still need to use these dang flares. But one flare is worth 30, so... 50, 60, 70, 80. There, if I sell these things down here, I should have enough. And I think a little bit extra to buy the thing from the wolf. Ah, I can make bandages too. Let's do that. Make a couple. I feel like it'd be a waste to go with the bandages with alcohol. So let's... Should I, should I use bandages or pills? The pills seem very effective. And they're also worth more, so I'm assuming they're considered better by the game. These are worth 40. Bandages worth 30. I'll keep those there. Okay. Do I want to keep these? Yes. I'll craft another lockpick. Why not? 
If I'm carrying two batteries with me, I probably don't need the torch. Oh wait, right, the torch is in case I have some goo that I need to like break. Ah, eh, I'm I'm gonna put it away. I want the storage space. Gas bottle, sure, I guess. That should be good. And just double check, make sure there's nothing I want to buy from them. Man, my reputation's so good. I really wish I knew if that did anything in particular. You know, can I just bank the reputation and just buy stuff? It just feels so rude to just... I mean, I'm basically just, like, abusing their trust if I did that. And they'd be putting up with it just because they like me enough. That's not right. I'm not gonna do it. Hmm. I'll use up some of my reputation. But not, like, all of it. Okay. Let's go turn off the generator. Okay. Head down the path to the wolf's camp buy the thing, and then maybe check out Pietrick's house? I don't know. We'll figure that out when we get there. Ah. God damn it, I didn't realize that was one of those bursters. Uh. Alright, it's fine. We can heal right here. Gonna wait a sec. That's not good. Oh, shiny stone there. Okay, they're not that hard to take out, actually. So do you have to be near the shiny stone for it to appear? Yeah, even if you mouse right over it, it doesn't appear. What if you shine a flash... Oh, if you shine a flashlight on it, it appears. Hmm. Interesting. What if there's been more shiny stones than I've found? Okay, that's a burster. So I'm... Yeah, camp should be, like, straight down. That... It's not pulsing. That one's pulsing, this one is not. Okay. Oh, thank god. Gas, alcohol, 14 nails, and another staff. Nice. Ah, I go down into these damn holes. I want to know if I can burn those holes or something. Okay, trade you that, and that, and that, for a toolbox, thank you. Yeah, I'll just leave it at that. Should I sell my shiny stone? I kind of want to collect these red eggs. 
I just wonder if they're just simply something you can eat, or if there's actually something special about them. I'm gonna keep my shiny. Ah, right, I was gonna put this gas bottle here. Although, I think I'd actually rather have the flashlight to search for shinies. Hmm? Maybe there's a dog in the yard? Well, that didn't sound good. Oh, we've got that goo in here. Ah, oh, damn, I should have brought the torch. Right, so whoever Piatrek is, they obviously tried to fortify their house. Got all sorts of lumber with what looks like razor wire slung around it. Not exactly extensively covering the house, but... It's something. So large. There's multiple parts to it. I'm thinking there's a dog in the backyard, so I'm gonna check that out first. Doesn't seem like it. I think it's inside the house. Okay, that did nothing. So yeah, I think it does have to be a source of fire. Something like a torch. I don't suppose I can craft one. I need a board and a match. Hmm. Junk pile. A pile of junk sloppily welted together. Meat. I guess I can get in behind the tractor. So this must be the farmhouse, and this is probably the sleeping house? Looks like it. This was once a tractor, now it's a hollow, rusty body. All of its useful mechanical parts have been scavenged. There's a heavy smell of gasoline in the air. this place ready to be ignited? I don't see a dog. Maybe it's in here. Looking for a board and a match. Okay. Actually, that will do. I'll just pour some gasoline on it. And light it on fire. Yeah, alright. No room. Um, I want to make sure I don't burn the mushrooms. So, let's dump an empty bottle. Close enough. Oh, come on. Why is it so hard to aim the matches? Okay. Oh. I'm sorry, doggy. So they can go through this stuff without any issues. The 
That's probably going to burn me if I touch it. Another mushroom in the corner. And a box. Just gotta wait. Junk tractor wheel. I find a toolbox right after I just bought one. Alright then. Blueprint. Oh. I thought that was like a recipe to make a new item. That must oh, that must have been the junk they were trying to weld together. This, this rocket ship. They're trying to build a rocket ship to get the hell out of here. They set their sights high. Well, the toolbox is worth quite a bit. I definitely want that. Um, meat's not that important. Yeah, that was supposed to be a rocket ship, wasn't it? Looks big and cylindrical. That must be the nose cone. Huh. Don't think there'd be any point in getting rid of this, but just in case there's something under it. Nah, there's nothing there. This looks like a scrap metal warehouse. The walls are covered with fungus and spider webs. It's very stuffy in here. Oh yeah, so this place smelled of gasoline. I mean, I threw some matches on the ground and they didn't just catch the whole place on fire, so... Don't know if I can do anything with that. I smell... Rosen? What's Rosen? I just looked it up. Rosen is apparently the solid form of resin. So you take resin and heat it up until certain things evaporate, and you get Rosen, which is solid and it had a pretty dizzying array of possible uses, so possible to tell exactly what it may have been used for in here, but given that this is like a metal workshop used for tinkering, it was used for something in the construction of that rocket ship or whatever else they were building. And I know that noise sounded like someone else walking, but it wasn't. I'm used to it now, kind of. Oh, tape for the first time. Tape that I've actually found in the world. Postcard with a portrait of a man. Someone has penned a caption on it. 1961, the sky is dark and the earth blue. What do I keep? What do I not? I guess I don't more meat. Okay. What's in here? I'm always scared to open the door. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Pietrek. Oh, they're... still here. Well, it looks like they're, like, whittling at something. Frantically. I don't think they're too interested in me.
Alright, seems like we're safe. And I can use their workbench if I want to. Hmm. Hello? Oh! They, um... Look like they've been affected by... Life in the dark wood. Oops, I didn't hear you come in. The boy's eyes are wandering around the room. The boy? They don't look that young to me. But yeah, they certainly look like um, a tinkerer. Tons of tools there, a map, and backpack full of stuff. Four separate watches. All spinning bizarrely fast. Kind of like a... Like antenna here, like a bug figure sort of profile on this helmet here, as well as on the stall. I found this wiggly metal thing yesterday. It was lying there, and laying there in the grass. I don't like grass. It's so slippery and it tickles your feet. Rather than grass, I would prefer these metal wigglies. Yes. The metal antennas on his wiry hat suddenly start vibrating. Do you, do you have any metal wigglies? Wire? I do. At home. I'm not sure if I have any on me. Show item. Okay, I can show them all sorts of stuff. Uh, let's do gossip. I haven't slept a wink today. The whole night, I thought about that large metal cover from the tractor. It's such a beautiful cover. Ideal cover, no doubts about that. I mean, almost, because I would need to bend it a bit with a screwdriver and... It will shield me. From the space dust, that is. Piatrex suddenly becomes sad. Space dust. Space dust is everywhere. So they made the blueprint. I like to watch the stars at night. Sometimes you can see these bright blinking spots. Those are spaceships and rockets, obviously. The sky is awfully boring during the day. No stars, no ships, no rockets, nothing. Only these white smoke trails. I saw one yesterday. Over there, far above the treetops. Dad used to say they were planes. But such long planes? It'd be crazy to fly them. Saw them just yesterday, so does that mean the world outside of the Darkwood is actually... at least relatively okay? It certainly can't be like life here if there's actual planes flying. All right, show them. Oh, the portrait of a man, that's probably their dad. Oh, I have one too. Such a beautiful photograph. I think that was their photograph that I took. Doesn't realize that there's only one, probably. Plastic chick. I had one just like this. I melted it into a perfect little ball shaped like the moon. I melt everything plastic into moons. Piatrex suddenly becomes excited. And have you seen my vehicle? It's ready. Well, almost ready. Just a couple of parts missing. I'll need to find them. And I will have to repair the casing. The one from the spring that fell off recently. When I was entering the cockpit, I hit my head and it, well, fell off. I thought I was flying, but it was just that the lights went off. Show them the blueprint. These are the blueprints for my space rocket. Almost ready. I broke down a whole tractor to build it. But I'm missing several parts. Several very important parts. For example, the shiny little mirror and this rectangular box with wires and... The boy suddenly becomes lost in thought. If only I had more tractors, I would definitely go to space. Photo of the road. You won't be able to make it home via this road. You should build a rocket. What do you have to trade? I like electronic and mechanical thingies, food, all sorts of stuff. Okay, so random things. Um, yeah, I don't have any wire thingies, but I should remember to bring some back. I'm gonna sell my extra toolbox, because I don't need two, right? I can sell my shiny stone, but what am I gonna buy, if anything? 
Do you have anything unique? Cable. I don't know if I've seen that before. Yeah, weapon parts, watch, etc., etc. So they sell wires. For what seems like a normal price. Um... I don't know if I want to buy anything in... Oh, they have a military flashlight. Ooh. Does this also run on 9-volt batteries? I used that during the flashback and it was significantly brighter. But I can only imagine that it probably uses more power as well. Or maybe it just holds more power. Like maybe it takes two 9-volt batteries instead of just one. Probably worth getting, but I can't afford it right now. Oh, map of the old woods. A piece of paper with two locations marked on it. The old woods is the one above us. I'm probably not going to go there for a while, but let's grab this. Maybe, maybe I'll get a metal pipe too. That'll probably come in handy for something. Maybe a cable too? Sure. I'm kind of in the minus. I don't really want to be in the minus. Let's give him something. Maybe this gas bottle? Because I'm going to go back home and once I upgrade the workbench I can make molotovs. So yeah, you can you can have that gas bottle. Did I pick... Wait, have I had this torch on me the whole time? Did I pack a torch but forget that I packed it? No way, right? But then when did I pick it up if I didn't? Uh, anyway. So I kind of just stole from him. I mean, not just then, but like when I looted this whole place. Doesn't seem to mind. I kind of feel bad about that. Doesn't look like it's dark yet. It's not turning orange. Locked. Generator room. I don't have an, I don't have any lockpicks. Did I use them all or forget to pack them or what? Huh. I could also barricade it, make it harder for, <laughs> for myself to get in. Okay. I'm betting it's probably pretty late. So I'm thinking maybe I should just head back. Oh yeah, that'll clear up an inventory space. Location found, church ruins, Old Woods hideout. Oh, the hideout there. That is incredibly important information to know. How far away am I from home? Eh, pretty good distance. I'm gonna go down, just see if there's anything in the woods and then head back. No, you know what? No. Given how dangerous it is, I'm gonna head back early. Given how dangerous the nights have been, I want plenty of time to prepare. So, let's go. So from here, head up, and then when the path starts to go right, head left. I mean, head right. When it goes right. Like here? Yeah. elk. Antlers are worth a lot. Yeah, definitely turning nighttime. That was the right call to start going home. Light's getting yellowish. Should be fine. Don't think the dog's gonna get me. Oh, I already drank today, apparently. Alright. Uh, let's go turn on the generator. I 
How are we doing on gas, by the way? Pretty good. Do I have any on me? I do. I've got a couple. Might as well fill it up. I'm sure we're going to be in this hideout for a while. I want to kind of complete this zone before I head to the old woods, probably. Okay. Oh, uh, we have mushrooms, don't we? Yes. Let's get rid of those. Okay. Let's get my... Better stick? Yeah. Let's get my better stick. Ooh, I am... I am out of space. That's a huge problem, actually. That's a really big problem. Is there like a wardrobe that I can put stuff in? That's not many slots. Um, shit, maybe I should craft some stuff. Okay, upgrade workshop. Yes. Oh, so stuff's been hiding. Well, I have to upgrade my workshop again to be able to make just a shovel. But yeah, it shows you only the stuff that you will be able to make in the next tier. So now that I've upgraded, I can make this stuff, and then here's teasing me for the next stuff. Which take... Oh, it takes another... It takes another tool thing. Oh no, I shouldn't have sold it. I didn't think it would use it again. Crap. Alright. Molotov. Let's make a bunch of these. And let's also make a chain trap. Should I make a single shot pistol? I need a bullet though. Do I even have a bullet? I do need a bullet, right? I mean, that's the shooty bit, but what is there to shoot? I have a magazine. I don't see any rounds. No, so that'd be useless for the moment. Okay, I definitely need to sell some stuff. Tape and... Ah. Okay, well, I'm going to put the chain trap out. Like, fan belt's not worth anything. Is it ever used? Oh, fuck. Fuck. Fuck, I spent too much time here. Pills, pills, pills. Yeah, I spent way too long crafting. Do they... How do they keep getting past the damn chain traps? How did you get past it? Are these just completely ineffective against these, like, higher tier enemies? Is that what's going on? I mean, look at that. Open the door and just, it's right there. So far it hasn't caught a single one of these. Where do these clothes come from? Oh, 
what? 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 The fuck? Fuck you. I ain't afraid of no ghosts. Unless the ghost looks like the ghost from last night, in which case I'm very terrified of it. That can't be good. Given the incredible ineffectiveness of these chain traps, I'm going to assume... Are you serious? I moved like... a quarter of a second before I disarmed it, I guess. Given the incredible ineffectiveness of these chain traps... I'm going to go ahead and make bear traps instead. It's too bad you can't scavenge, like, one bit of scrap from them. When you uh, set them off. Um, so I can make two bear traps. Like, I really don't get it. Is it just... I don't see why it wouldn't trigger. I could understand if they would break them very quickly because they're stronger enemies, but it's not even triggering. It's very strange. Oh, wait a minute. The shotgun doesn't require weapon parts, does it? It just requires two barrels and... And, uh, some scrap, but it says useless after firing a shot. So it's a very temporary weapon. So a pistol would definitely be what I'd want to go for. More renewable. Hmm. So I should probably move some of this more useless stuff into maybe the generator place. Just to spread it out. You know, like the battery and the fan belt, things that... Hey, wait a minute. I wonder... I wonder if, um... What was her name? I wonder if Piatrek would be interested in that stuff. Because they're a tinker and they're trying to build things, right? They wanted more tractor parts. Oh, I bet they would be. Yeah, and they're also interested in... Wiggly things, which I think might be wires? Possibly? Or antlers? I don't know. Hmm. Yeah, so I think I'm actually going to take the battery and the fan belt with me over to them. To Piatrek. Broken glass, like, I'm not even going to bother with that. 
I should just like throw that away. Oops, drop it. Okay, well, I think I'm gonna save that for the next episode, do some inventory management off camera before we head out to Pietrex's house to see if they want the battery and the fan build. But I hope you've enjoyed so far, and when I return, we are going to do just that. <laughs>